Now, the rest of tonight, you can expect some clouds around, patchy fog, uh, still a chance of an isolated shower, very small chance of some thunder. That chance of one of those spotty showers will stick around early tomorrow morning as temperatures dip into the low 60s up here across Trumbull and Mercer counties, a little bit warmer down south to get out the door in the morning. And then through the day tomorrow, I do expect scattered clouds to hang on. Some peaks of sunshine will work its way on through. Uh, temperatures pushing back up close to 70 degrees by lunchtime. Uh, any risk of showers tomorrow would be early in the morning. Uh, the rest of the afternoon, just some clouds around and high temperatures only pushing back through the 70s. So uh, not as hot tomorrow and not as humid either. A few clouds around tomorrow night, but overall pretty quiet weather expected into the start of your Thursday. And overall, Thursday doesn't look too bad either. Uh, some peaks of sunshine, but the clouds coming from the tropical system to the south uh, will keep trying to fill in through the day, and uh, that'll filter the sun at times. And overall, a fairly quiet weather for a couple of days. That chance of rain showers sneaks back in as we go into Friday as that tropical system works its way northward and interacts uh, with the northern system. So the rest of tonight, uh, down to 60, a scattered shower, small chance for a thunderstorm for the rest of the overnight. We're all done with those big storms here at home. Uh, tomorrow, 78 degrees, scattered clouds, uh, isolated shower in the morning, just a small chance at that. Then some clouds around through the afternoon. A seven-day forecast, a temperature back in the low 80s on Thursday. Uh, the risk of showers do return on Friday. And again, a lot of that hinges on the track of uh, Debbie as uh, the storm makes its way up toward Pennsylvania. Uh, going into Saturday and Sunday, some clouds around temperatures in the mid 70s. I threw a small risk of a shower in for Sunday and Monday. It looks like there's a better chance of that up toward the northern snow belt because the air is cool enough coming across the Great Lakes that may produce some lake effect showers. Uh, but overall, fairly quiet weather and cooler temperatures on into next week.